Hi guys, this is Aaron from Wine Cult, and welcome back to another Bottle Breakdown. Today we're talking about the 2021 Revealed Rosé of Grenache from Sean Best. Uh, but first, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Um, as you've heard me say before, your likes are one of the best ways that we can get Wine Cult content in front of new people. In fact, uh, your liking and subscribing is the only thing that really impacts the YouTube algorithm. So we're very appreciative of you guys uh, endorsing our content. Now this Rosé of Grenache is the first wine to be released uh, by a brand new winemaking duo that is spearheaded by our friend, Sean Best. Uh, Sean is a wine broker by day who's had his eye on making wine from exceptional vineyards throughout the central coast of California. Uh, and he has teamed up with winemaker Elisa Jacobson of Turning Tides Wines to make his dream a reality. Elisa considers herself an environmentalist and an outdoor enthusiast uh, who's followed her passion for agriculture and the sciences from a pretty early age. She was raised in California's Sacramento San Joaquin Delta, and growing up in and around farms really instilled in her this lifelong desire to find ways to help protect that land, and specifically the water supply, uh, and to educate people about preserving natural resources. So she founded her own wine brand, Turning Tide, in 2018 and launched her first wines in 2020. Now we featured her 2020 white blend a couple of months ago, so are really, really excited to be supporting her other ventures. Now she met Sean, the founder of Revealed, through his day job as a wine broker, and their friendship pretty quickly turned into this exciting partnership. Sean was born into a restaurant family, so he ran a restaurant and sold wine in LA while uh, interning at an art gallery in Santa Monica. He has an art degree uh, from the Art Center Pasadena in fine arts and illustration, so naturally he's designed his own wine label, uh, even before winemaking was, was on the brain. Uh, Sean really decided to incorporate his artwork into the labels, uh, the first of which can be seen on this rosé. Uh, it's an abstract painting that he did back in high school, which depicts the Southern California coast. Sean believes that sustainable farming is an important aspect of winemaking and is pretty excited that the vineyards that Elisa works with align with that vision. Uh, so to make wine made with love from grapes uh, to really canvas the people and the place. Strawberry and stone fruit on the nose, uh, very gentle but beautiful minerality of uh, pretty bright acidity. Uh, it's perfect for warm summer weekends that we're having right now. So for more bottle breakdowns and other great wine content, don't forget to subscribe. I'm Aaron from Wine Cult and I'll see you next time.